Hello everyone. So in today's video, I will be giving some tips and suggestions about composting. Like to tell you all is many people face this uh, problem of insects and fruit flies and even sometimes maggots uh, you know uh, growing in these containers so how to prevent them so the easiest way of doing this is either use turmeric powder or what you call it as haldi powder which is yellow in color as you can see in this video now that uh, we are applying uh, turmeric powder also called haldi to the inner side of the lid uh, this is because uh, this is mostly the place where the uh, maggots or the insects or the fruit flies basically come and start growing and they get uh, stuck to that uh, inner side of the lid that's why when you put uh, haldi or turmeric powder uh, it basically acts as a repellent and it basically prevents these insects from uh, uh, hiding in those areas you should also apply the turmeric powder on the walls of the uh, bin on this is because uh, that will basically prevent any of these insects or uh, fruit flies from uh, staying inside the bin and you can also add a little bit and of it and mix it with the uh, compost that is being made inside the bin so this is the bin which we just started putting the waste so uh, we are putting now uh, the turmeric powder on the inner side of that as well So you can put the turmeric powder uh, once or twice a week, that's more than enough. The other option, the costly option is going for neem powder. Neem powder, neem cake is available in the local market as well as on Amazon. But the problem is it's very expensive and uh, that's why I don't prefer that. But in case if you want to go for that, you can always uh, buy that as well. Uh, details about neem powder and turmeric powder that is haldi powder is given in the description below one more thing that i would like to tell you all is suppose if you are not making a compost bin at home and you are buying it from amazon or some other uh, online market or maybe from a local store how many compost bins should you be having at home and what would, what should be the size of the compost bin that is very important so today i will be talking about that as well so i am using a 60 liter uh, water drum as a compost bin there are two of them because this takes almost uh, one one and a half month to fill and that's the reason why i have kept this because the composting process takes place in uh, 35 to uh, 50 55 days so uh, still that also depends upon a lot of other factors like the size of your uh, waste that is being put in the compost bin so uh, very important that suppose if you have some garden waste or some banana peels or maybe some orange peels uh, don't uh, put such big big pieces into the compost bin. The degradation process becomes very slow because it's a big part of so it takes time for it to uh, get broken down into small things. So very important that you use a scissor or something and break it into as small as possible so that the process becomes faster and your compost will be ready in 35 to 45 days. Otherwise, if you are using uh, very big particles, like suppose uh, you have a banana tree and you are cutting the banana leaf, which is so big, and uh, just putting it in the compost bin without cutting it, then that will remain in for a lot of time and that will not get degraded in the compost. The second thing that I would like to tell you all is that uh, based on your family size, so if you are a family of three or four, if you are using or buying a compost bin, which is say of 20 liters, then it's very important that uh, you buy at least three compost bins. The reason being, the 20 liter compost bin will be uh, full by uh, 15 days or maybe 20 days max. So you require at least three compost bins 
because then only you will be able to put your daily waste into the bin and uh, you will not have the need to uh, give it to the government authorities for disposal. So uh, that's one more thing that I wanted to tell you all about. But if you are having a family of maybe two and if you are using the 20 litre or 15 litre bin uh, for a month, then I think two bins will be more than enough. But to be on a safer side, use three bins so that you don't need to worry. I hope uh, all this was very useful and I hope you guys uh, start composting. Uh, I'll be seeing how I get this, uh, the type of response that I get from people and uh, if there are a lot of questions and queries regarding composting then I'll be making one more video maybe after a month about uh, the doubts that you have had regarding composting. So till then happy composting, happy gardening.